we're here for a calendar launch. That's right, we're here for the Pumped Up Done Under calendar launch. You are November? I am November this year, yes. So I've done the calendar. This is my fourth year. Fourth year. So, yeah, it's great. You're an expert. Well, I should be by now, shouldn't I? Absolutely. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave you here tonight. Yeah. I'm going to scoot off to the Crown Casino for the guys' launch, for the footy players' launch. And you're going to stay here talking to the girls and everybody I'm else. I'm party, babe. All right. Well, I'll leave it to you. Enjoy the night. Thank I'll you. I'll see you in the crowd. All right. We're going to have a good night tonight, guys. Interview some of the calendar girls, and uh, I think we'll have time to have a bit of a party as well. What do you think? Look at this, you've bought a calendar. Who's your favourite footy? It would be Brad Ottens. Why Brad? Because I'm a Richmond supporter. Oh, you're just going for the team, are you? <laughs> so you're hoping that cute, these guys are all going to sign he's, he's actually on my birthday in the calendar, so... He's on your birthday? Yeah. That must be a sign, I reckon. Yeah. So how much have you purchased this for? Fifteen dollars. Fifteen bucks. And uh, the signatures and autographs are priceless, yes? Yes. Now, are you going to be bidding? Uh, maybe not. Why not? Oh, I don't know. Didn't bring enough money, maybe? Oh, OK. That could, that could, <laughs> that could do it. Yes, indeed. We'll just wander through and see... Oh, look at this. You've got one. Who's your favourite? Oh, well, actually, I'm here chaperoning my nieces. Yeah, yeah, that's what they all say, right? Paul Mercurio. He's pretty good. And you're going to go up to Paul, right, and say, can you sign this for my niece, aren't you? Absolutely. Look, nah, I'm spewing. They've got my niece. Poor excuse. We've heard that one all before, haven't we? Absolutely. I have to blame someone. you're going to be bidding for your niece? We'll see. <laughs> all depends. How old's your niece? Uh, 21. Oh, 21. <laughs> and so, uh, what, you're a footy follower or not? Yeah, I am. Who's your team? Carlton. Carlton. Yeah. And who don't do you? Don't say anything else. That's it. No, I was going to leave it at that. Okay, good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't mess with this woman. <laughs> So you're a bit young, how old are you? 20. 20. How are you going to handle 20,000 screaming women out there? 20,000? Yeah. Jeez, that's an exaggeration. It, it is a little bit, but it'll sound like there's 20,000 out there, believe me, when they start seeing you out there. Oh, it should be alright, I'll just stand behind Maddie and see how we go. Matt's the big protector, is he? Yeah, he is. He is. Do you, get, do you find it overwhelming, all this stardom, and just because you're a footy player, you play football, now it's almost, you know, it's about celebrity status as well? Yeah, it is a bit. Oh, I don't really get noticed or anything like that. So, Yet. Uh, so yeah, hopefully it stays like that. Otherwise, the coach might, uh, might not be too happy. But uh, why is that? You're you know on a calendar. It's all going to start somehow. Yeah. Just worry about playing good footy. I think. Yeah. That's the priority, isn't it? Definitely. definitely. So you go out in the sand, drink a lot, all that sort of stuff. Nah, not really, mate. In the off season, have a bit of fun, but uh, not really during the season much. It's strict. Yeah, training what every day or? Yeah, we get one week day off, but um, yeah, training. So you just sleep yeah. that day, yeah? Yeah, pretty much. Don't do much. Well, I mean, that's to be expected, you know. I'm going to play until next year and full pre-season and start again. Yeah. And uh, that means being injured, you've had plenty of time to get in the gym. No, no, no. I've been together yeah. four years. Rich, Rich no sirens! Sirens, yeah. you were so excited! And we just got oh, I know we're so excited! I can, t I can feel the energy. <laughs> now tell me you got a new single coming out. We sure do! Yeah. It's been released last week, yes, like that. Like that and like that. Like you sing? Fire, like rain. Like fire, like when rain. When I can talk, I can sing. Okay, you're going to do that tonight? Yes, we are. <laughs> Oh,
your football fan? Um, all I know is Dave Spriggs, just because he's my mate. Yes, go against. Go to Geelong. Yeah. Geelong. Go to Geelong. I live in Geelong. Oh, oh okay. Geelong. You're a Geelong girl too. I still live there. I think I got out years ago. Did you? Oh, come on, we love Some never get out. <laughs> so tell us the new single, how's it been going? Uh, well, it went to radio last yep. week. Um, it's been played on Mix FM. Thank you, Mix. <laughs> and um, three times a day. Goes to video day. hits this weekend. Oh, fantastic! Yeah, so there's a competition running for three weeks. Okay, what's the and, competition? Um, Win a date with you girls? No, actually, no. They, don't, they don't actually tell us. It's off. Girl. Yeah. Sports girl voucher with a stereo and all that. Well, what can I do with a sports girl voucher? Well, you could buy you presents for people. You could, oh, have you I want the date with the three girls. I do. <laughs> I That's a tea. <laughs> I want to talk to Video Hits about this because normally they do that. Well, we can know. arrange it. If, if you want yeah. to work out your own competition, we'll we can just go for a coffee now. What do you say? Okay. Yeah. 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 Well, just out the back, out the back room. <laughs> So who did the video clip? Um, a guy called Mark Hartley. Very yeah. good. Very good. Um, Is it hard? Uh, it was. It was about a 17 hour day. Okay. So about a seven degree day. It was next freezing and we're in a car wash. And there's oh, okay. um, so you have to shower in the All car nipples are, are out oh, there, yeah? Me? Cold. What's it's for the children to watch. Anyway, we go through the car wash and um, we're in a convertible beat up. And, um, so you go in looking like this and you come out frizzed? No, no, we no. Sort of. We kind of oh, do. We go in cash and come out and it up. <laughs> <laughs> and we have um, some spunky boys washing our car and then it turns into a dream and they take their tops off and they start washing our car seductively. <laughs> But we don't. And children are watching this, and yeah, she no, says, you know, make much sense, mm. does it? tear up the dance floor in the car wash. Yeah, and then there's a foam party, and the foam sort of. And these dancers just appear. Who <laughs> came up with the concept? Uh, Mark Hartley. Mark Hartley. Once again, yeah. yeah. It's very realistic. Well, you don't have any import. You yeah. Oh, yeah, every time I go to the car wash, that happens. Girls yeah. start dancing yeah, in disco yeah, ball drops down. Yeah. <laughs> Up and under calendar. Um, April, one off my birthday month. <laughs> oh, that's a lucky chance. And what scenario did you do this year? Scenarios in the scene. I meant to be a boxer. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> okay, and you got front cover. That's very good. Oh, deal for your first time. Um, yeah, pulled it off pretty well. I don't know. It was um, pretty fluky. It's alright. It's a bit of a surprise, you know. Um, it's a bit of fun, and I was just yeah, lucky to get the front cover. I don't know. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> I think you've got a great future ahead of you. Are you having a good night tonight? Yeah, you too. And I'm sure we'll be seeing a lot of you. Hope so. We'll see how we go. <laughs> Matthew, how's the hand going? 
Yeah, because you're gonna be good. signing a lot of signatures out there. Nah, yeah. Hopefully, hopefully everyone has a good night. I mean, uh, it just goes to a good cause, uh, the Trevor Barker Foundation. So hopefully, we can raise enough money uh, and uh, give a few donations. How did you find the photo shoot yourself? Yeah, oh, I thought she wasn't too bad. It was really cold when I actually did it, so I was uh, freezing my ass off. But uh, no, it was, a, it was good. Just a, it didn't take that long, but um, got through it, and uh, hopefully the photos come up good. So when you you haven't seen the photos, the prints? Oh, I've got a, got a couple got of prints, off. but um, I wasn't sure which one you going to use. So. Okay. So what do you see when you look at the print? Do you see you in there or something else? No, okay, yeah, it's a bit, a bit funny, like looking at yourself like that, in yeah. different poses and stuff. So, but, uh, hopefully, yeah. I'm sure Mum loves it. Yeah, mum's got, got up on the wall. So, yeah, mum's got it up on the wall. So, yeah, hopefully, uh, yeah, it comes up good. So. And how are you going to find it out here tonight with all these screaming uh, women? Yeah. Can you handle the attention? Nah, it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, oh, and, you're an old pro, yeah? Nah, I don't know about that. But, uh, nah, just hopefully, uh, like with the, um, with the support that they can get with the most of the yeah. money and stuff, so it's good. <laughs> more fun. I'm just actually waiting for a few footballers to come. So, see you soon. We'll keep moving through the crowd. Basically what they're going to do is auction off some uh, prints and stuff. All the footy players are going to be up on stage and uh, everybody's going to be screaming. Are you ready to scream? I certainly am. So are you going to be bidding? I think I might be actually. Really? What are you going to bid for? I have no idea. It depends what comes up and what looks good. What looks good to you then? What looks good to me and all my friends here? Yes. <laughs> yes. A good ass. A good ass. That's what you look for in these yeah. players. And a, six, and a good six pack. No, a good six smart. pack. Yep. They've yeah. got to be smart. And nice hair. <laughs> you don't want much, do you? No. no. Right. Not at all. Simply smart. That's all we ask for is a smart. So you put string a three-word sentence together. <laughs> you won't be at the end of the night. That's for sure. Keep going that way. Just like uh, a bit more champagne. Do you watch football for the reason of football, or just for good ass abs and everything else that you want? Um, a bit of both, but mainly for the ass and the abs. So, yeah. <laughs> so, there you go.
Here's a bit of a left turn, 25 in the wheel and two to the mid. And two to the mid, you're done. Three for me, stick with me on the left, 275, three to the mid. And it's Hottie Hamill. Hottie Hamill. And 250, second 275 for me now, 275 and three. And three to 325, 350 if you like. Personally, so. 350, 375, here on the left hand side, 375, say four. And four, we got 425 now, say 450 if you will. What made you do that? What made you decide I'm going to do it? I'm going to be in the calendar. Um, oh well, I, I've got a, a few interests in the outside footy. I like to keep myself pretty busy. And um, well, you think you're a bit of a model then? Nah, not at all. Nah, not at all. I just got uh, pretty lucky to be chosen. And so yeah, it was just mate, just to keep me keep just an interest in the outside football. Yeah. So what did you think of the uh, the end result of the photos? Oh, it's amazing. They, um, it's amazing. Got a little bit of makeup and a bit of a touch up can do. Do you see yourself in there? Do you look at you and go, God, that's not me. It's better than who I am. Yeah, I do actually. Yeah, yeah no, I, I actually don't really look look at it. You know, I just sort of flick flick past it. I don't really want to look at it too much. But you getting uh, a bit fussy now. Like, oh, I should have done that. I should have did this. Uh, or, no, 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 not at all. Mate. I just. I just look at it and I'm amazed that uh, you know, it comes out like that. So would you then try and pursue a career in modelling or doing something like that? Or? No, I'm not, no, I'm just in the footy at this stage. It's a bit of fun. Yeah, yeah. just in the football. So how's the football season going for you? Yeah, it's, it's going all right actually. We, um, we're sitting third on the ladder now, Collingwood that is, and uh, we've got, a, pretty, we got a, uh, a few tough games to go, but hopefully we can play some good finals footy. Do you get nervous towards the end of the year, like when we get up to grand final stage? Do you get a bit, bit more anxious? Uh, yeah, we do. We, we, we get a little bit nervous. I mean, we've never played finals, or not myself yeah. anyway, so... Is there a lot of pressure? There is, there is a fair bit of pressure yeah. there, but I mean, it's all for fun. I mean, we all enjoy playing, so when yeah. we play to play finals, so it's going to be good. So does your coach do... I know in soccer they say you're not allowed to have sex before a big game and things like that. Is it the same for you guys? Do you get told all that? Uh, no, nah, not really, no. no. Not anymore, oh, so anyway. I think maybe 10 years ago, but not now. Yeah? yeah. Oh, so you're a free man then? Yeah. We are, we're free nice. game. Well, plenty of chicks here. There's all those supermodels out there. There's a few good looking girls about. Hey. The crown, right? And half the footy players are here at Frostbite. So I've come back. I'm joined with Scotty Lucas, yeah, Essendon, yeah? Yeah, it was a bit of an ordinary game last night, but. Pretty I'm ordinary. So tell me, why aren't you in the calendar? Why aren't you hey, a calendar? 
a start. It should be. Maybe you should ask the girls tonight. Oh, okay. Now you're his mate. Mate, he has chicks everywhere. That's why you're hanging on, isn't hey, it? I'm trying to get some of the swaps. But you know, you've got roadies. Does he follow you wherever you go? Uh, he's a good bloke, this young fella. He looks after me. He looks after you. You? How tall are you? How yeah, what? How tall are you? 6'4". 6'4". And you've got to look after... He's got to look after you. I have 6'2". Yeah, I mean, come on. I think he can hold his own. Yeah, I think he can. So you're a basketballer? Yeah, I play for Kilsai. Why not, why not footy? Uh, I, played, I played footy as a uh, junior, but then basketball took over, so... Oh, OK. A bit of a ball man, dude. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, you know, do you practice footy or...? I'm trying, to, I'm trying to turn him over, but it's no go at the moment. Too much money in football. Get hard to change a footy play, isn't it? So are you enjoying tonight? Yeah, it's going around. I like the old strawberry daiquiris. They go around. Right. Do you get recognised here or not? Uh, a little bit. I, I don't like to be recognised too much. Hey, drink card. Drink card, yeah. Use it for the drink card. Hey, Give me a drink. Well, you're only using it for the drink card, so that's all right. Your yeah, boy's got hangers on us, you know. They're everywhere, but, you know, that's what you get. So you're going to push through the crowd because Renee's here somewhere because I left her here and I went to Crown, but I followed some footy players back through and I don't know where she's gone. She's probably talking to some glamour girls. We'll see what she's up to. We'll squash through. There's a few footy players here and there. Everybody's getting a bit rowdy and drunk. It's quite a good crowd, actually. Oh, yes. What are you drinking? What are you drinking? Just a, just a mel, mate. You're carrying on that just over a mel? I don't know. Unbelievable. Hey, you got a calendar? Yes, I did. You bought a calendar? Oh, you've got the man one, yeah? Yeah. So who's your hunk? I'm Trixie. It's Trixie. It's Brizzy. Why? Springsy, why? Have you seen his photo? We got the last year's calendar too. Oh, have you got it signed yet? Where do we get it signed? Yeah, you got to get it signed. Wait, where? we got to find it. Are you serious? He'll be in here somewhere. Woo! So you had a good okay. night? Yeah. So you're like football stalkers or what? <laughs> a little bit. No. Yeah, come on, admit it, you are. Just a little bit. Now, have you seen any footy players here? I wouldn't know them if I could. know them. It's if probably a good thing. There's a few of them, actually. We'll head down the bar. We'll keep moving across. See how everybody's going, pushing through. Yeah, whatever, mate. Yeah, you're not a footy player. Who? You. Yeah, I am. Who are you, then? Yeah, if you don't know me, keep walking. All right, I don't know you. I'm walking. Found you. You found me. Yes. I just come back you from... You know what? Isn't this more exciting than Crown? It was. It is. It is? And some of the footy players followed, well, I followed them here. Really? So I just want to say thanks for doing this tonight. Pleasure. You had fun? I had an absolute ball. Thanks, Oh, that's Steve. good. No, that's Anytime. great. Anytime. We'll have to see you more on the show then. I think so. What do you guys? reckon, guys? Do you yeah. A, a, a seriously good-looking girl will just make my ratings go up. That's amongst it. other things. Oh, <laughs> Steve. Okay.